Alrighty guys, here's an update on the last year. Uh, last I checked a couple days ago, there was about five to six little workers in there with these two queens. They, I'm, I don't know how to get them to move. I've heard that they are super stubborn. As you can see, this test tube of this cotton is completely bone dry. So I'm not sure what needs to be done. I'm just kind of being patient with them, allowing them to take their own little time. I do have a fresh test tube over here covered um, that has fresh water in there for them. Um, so I do see them occasionally. I do see the workers coming from that test tube. So I'm assuming that that's where they're, they're getting their water normally, but I'm not sure why they haven't bothered to move yet. Um, but yeah, hopefully here soon, do have them in this little AC setup here. Um, they are utilizing it because there is their trash. I need to get in there and clean that out. I do have a drop of nectar I put in there for them. And then a piece of roach that was just freshly molted. So it should be nice and squishy. I did cut the head up, cut it open up at the top. Um, so hopefully they get a nice little feed here after about almost a week of um, their last meal, which yeah, I believe I did like three, four fruit flies. So hopefully they'll chow down on some roach. Um, that's the goal. Like I said in one of my other videos, did run out of fruit flies, so I was trying to incorporate all the other feeders that I have so but yeah here's these beautiful ladies still going strong doing good as you can see if you look on the other side of the queens there is a few pupae eggs and everything up underneath them where they're at so hopefully we can entice them to move over but yep here's the beautiful Lassius again